Yo, yo, yo! What's up, y'all? It's time for part two of the Five Finger Death Punch Marathon. Let's trip it on, baby. Today, we're going to be checking out uh, their second album, The Answer is War. Y'all ready to get into it? Let's get it, man. That's what you call an anthem right there, boy. That's what you call an anthem. Let's keep it going. Spitting bars, man. Them lyrics are shining on this album, man. Let's keep it going. Listen, man, you guys think I hate every slow song. I don't, man. That was a good, solid song. This album has a concept, and the song fit within the concept of what this album is going for, man. And that's dope, man. Let's keep it going. Yet another solid song. Let's keep it going. That's dope when you throw in an instrumental like that, man. That's dope. Let's keep it going.
come to the end, man. Final thoughts about this album. This is a straight up solid album, man. Uh, there were lots of uh, just good songs on here, not great songs. When I say solid, I mean uh, our press play, let it play, and uh, a lot of songs would turn into background sounds. A lot of these songs sounds like it can be it can be played on the radio. It comes with that generic formula of the build up, the hook, the verse, the hook, the ballad breakdown bridge, and the hook. So it's very formulaic, man, and, and for that reason, I'm gonna be skipping around on this album, man. Uh, this album right here is a, is a playlist ready album. Um, it's not something I'm gonna listen to as a whole. I'm gonna be plucking songs out of it and coming back to it, uh, especially uh, those uh, war related songs that directly relate to the title, uh, like No One Gets Left Behind. That song is the best song in this album, and songs like that that's related to that concept. Uh, other than that, it's just an okay album. I'll be plucking some songs out of it. Just my thoughts. Till next time, I'm